Well, whatever time of day or night it is with you, welcome along to a game which is threatened, I have to tell you, by a rather forbidding weather forecast. The expectation is for quite heavy rain as the game grows older this evening. It hasn't arrived just yet, but it will do shortly. Glad to report, though, that that hasn't affected the crowd, who are here in good number and indeed in good voice. And the game will be underway very soon. So oh, what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? I'm going to go for the experienced Igor Akinfeyev. He's always been an agile stopper, but having been on the scene from, from such a young age, he's a much calmer decision-maker these days. Yes, they'll certainly be leaning heavily on him. So it's down to business here. Gets it back. the shot! Goal! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Krasnodar take the early advantage. Great run this, he's covered quite a distance. That's a good block, but at the expense of a corner. Vlasic goes short. Very far from making something happen by himself, lovely to see. Krasnodar scored early, of course, and the score is 1-0. Vlasic. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. over the line plays it out wide has it out wide now that had too much on it That is very well defended. Vlasic has given away a free kick. Corner given. Defending, albeit from an unexpected source. 
I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line of that defence and, and he's delivering. Keeper's got good distance on that. What a ball this has turned out to be. Shoots! Good clearance and very necessary. Krasnodar are in control here on the brink of hot Shapes to shoot! He's got away with one there. You lucky boy, you lucky, lucky boy. Giving the ball away like that is usually punished. And it's played forward. Receives it. Shot a goal! Oh, denied brilliantly! Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. And the whistle goes for half time. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Here we go again. CSKA Moscow don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back, though. Dinks one in. That'll go straight through to the keeper. Down by a goal, needing to go up a gear. That's how it looks here. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, the stats are pretty telling here. It's hard to argue with the scoreline when you carry so little threat. CSKA Moscow are definitely going about this the right way. Well, a hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? It just has to be done. He's got options out wide. Vlasic. Lovely bit of skill. Away from immediate danger. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Vlasic. He'll hit it! 
hoists it forward. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. And he's on a charge. The referee's awarded a free kick. Looks to clip it forward. Now can he finish? CSK in Moscow are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. And the referee brings it to a close. Always in the balance, and in the end, one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? It's just a bad day at the office, Peter. They look below par. In all